Hi friends, now we are going to talk about how you can process BTC session. So the transaction code is SM38, SM35, okay, and here you can see all this BTC session that probably was pushed in error and all those things. So if you want to see details about this, you can click on statistics and here you can see there is still to be processed 99 entries which has two screens each. So that's why we have 198 and if you want to process you can click on process thing if you if it's locked you can unlock it so if i click on process here you can process is bdc foreground display errors only all this information is very important okay and if you want to delete you can also delete this okay so generally the ones that are already processed you need to delete it otherwise this add up in the system and creates at the end of the day it's junk data because if, in, if there's something available from 2018 it needs to be deleted okay so those are the information which is very handy handy and this is very useful when there is interfaces which fails because there is some errors and they post post it in uh, in a session so that when i process it in foreground so let me show you if i let me take this one Okay, let's see what we see. If I process this in foreground, it will show me these things. And here, if there's any error, I can I, I can correct it or do something. Okay, so this is the way it is. Okay, so this is very helpful. Suppose in this case there were some errors, the 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 person who is fixing the error they can change the data and post it about it. So that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning. And if you like it, share and subscribe to it and have